This is Bishop Dr. Truman Burst. A master herbalist. Uh, coming to you from Good Shepherd Ministries. some colonial silver water. So I warmed up some water here on the stove and the water is nice and warm and because the best temperature for the water to be would be about 139 degrees oh, and there it is. It's all the way to the top Okay, and I'm going to put this over here and start our next dish. You guys like that. And there we go. Now we've got some Alaskan salmon burgers for dinner. Uh, that's not probably the cold or the silver water, but it just kind of jumped in there. And we got salmon burgers going now. Uh, okay, wash your hands. Okay, and all right now. Now we've got this uh, water, and I want to make sure that it isn't too hot. And I'm going to turn this down to here. And let's see if I have a thermometer. I might have a thermometer. Might I have a thermometer? above 140 it falls out of suspension so we're at 124 that's going to make a nice batch of colloidal solar water okay so we take that all right put this up on the counter here and let's see are we are, can you can you see me up me I put it over over there I think that let's see are you able to see that did I do it? Kind of. Mainly. Mostly. All right. Move it over here. And get the colloidal soda water generator. And a couple of wires. Just my backup wires. And let's see here. So uh, this is how easy it is. Take this. Clip it to the, to the alligator clip. Just like that. And put it down in here, put it 
Yeah, up against the side like that. That's pretty good. Uh, this is actually kind of straight, so I'm going to click right like that. Or like this. Ah, okay. Are we getting anywhere? No. Okay, I'm going to find a good way to clip this. Ah, oh, that's better. That's just, that's fine. Okay, so now, got that one down in there. And we take this other alligator clip. And we clip it in there. And oh, look at how bright that light is. That's, one, that's the only use that light has, is to make sure that you've got a good connection and you get strong batteries. Okay, we got strong batteries. We got a good connection, and we're going to put these rods down in here, and we're going to, well, that's touching again. I'm having a lot of fun. Okay, so I'm getting, getting these fixed to where they are making an X, and but they are not being friendly. So, um, it's, it takes a while sometimes to get it where you want it. And that's getting real close. And I have an X there, practically. So I'm happy. And those are really close. So, I'm going to keep them about a half inch apart. Okay? There we go. I'm going to pull that in just a little bit. Oh, that's really close. Okay, that's perfect. Okay, I'm going to bring this over here so you can see how, how that is, all right? Okay, we're just going to bring that right over here. Oh, and I'm going to lose everything. But anyway, when you take a look here at how the rods are, the rods are down in there and not touching, about a half inch apart. And uh, that's how they're supposed to look. So now that we've got the rods set, okay, and the water, okay, now let's, there we go. Now, let us put a little Himalayan sea salt in there, pink salt. Add a little bit of minerals, create a little conductivity. I don't even have, that's, that, that's plenty right there. All I need is about a few grains. That's it. Okay, just a few grains. I didn't even have to grind it. Just, just a, a three to six grains is great. That's fine. Now, this is going to work just fine because that's all you have to do. That's it. Where's my wooden spoon? I need a wooden spoon. There's a wooden spoon. So, so now we take this wooden spoon and we use a hand leader. And we kind of stir this around a little bit. That pulls the silver off the rods. So every now and then we'll do that. Now I'm going to set the timer for 40 minutes. Okay, that's all I need to do. And I'm done. Set 40 minutes. There it goes. Start. And every 40 minutes, where are you? Here I am. So, every 40 minutes, you can make a batch of colloidal silver water. And that's how you do it. That's how it is. And it comes all ready to go out of the box. So you don't have to, you know, do anything, fix anything. Uh, it's just ready to go. And then you stir it every now and then. Timer set for 40 minutes. Every 40 minutes, you have one gallon of approximately 25 parts per million colloidal silver water. And that will last you at least six, eight months. If And I keep it down here at room temperature in the cupboard. I never touch it with metal. I only touch it with wood or plastic, and that's how to make colloidal silver water. That's it, in 40 minutes, 
I will have a cloudy bunch of colloidal silver water. That's it. I'll put that right there because I'm going to come back and stir it every now and then. That's all there is to it. Hey, are you there? Okay. Alright, you just learned how to make colloidal silver water.